Um, tell us a little bit about Indiana and what you have learned this far. Um, they're a very balanced team. Uh, they've got big posts inside. Uh, they've got a very talented point guard that can penetrate, and then they've got shooters outside that can balance off that penetration. So like I said, a very balanced team uh, that likes to get up and down and score, but a team that I definitely think we can compete with. Joni seemed to think that y'all might have a bit of an edge rebounding wise, mm -hmm. but yeah. the, she said that they also like to run, they like to go in transition, and yeah. they're pretty good defensively, mm -hmm. you know, man and zone. Um, as far as your offense is concerned, what do y'all got to do? Uh, like you said, they're a team that is very susceptible uh, on the board, so I do think that we can rebound against them. They're less athletic than us. I mean, they have a couple of athletes that are on the floor, but overall they like to run the ball, but they're nowhere near as athletic as we are. So I think that, you know, we can control the game um, in that way and hopefully, you know, get some boards, get some easy shots inside using our athleticism. And then we just got to execute the game plan. I mean, the coaches have spent a lot of time studying them. So if we go out there and we execute like we can, then I think we'll come out with a win. Um, one other thing that we talked about with Joni was, you know, y'all have an interesting mix of veterans and, you know, some newcomers. Mm -hmm. And you've been to this tournament before, so I feel pretty certain that y'all talk with the younger players about just getting there is not enough. Yeah. Getting there is an expectation. So for us, you know, our, our goal is to get there and win games ultimately because it's one and done at this point in the season. I think that everybody understands that. That's the culture that we're brought up in. So the expectation is that we go out there and win. Excellent. With that being said, how does it feel to have the chance to go to the tournament compared to last year? Uh, it definitely feels great. It's something that we emphasize in the off season and then throughout season. It was a huge goal for us to get back um, into the tournament because we didn't last year. We felt like we let a lot of people down. We let ourselves down. Um, so getting back there, yeah, that's a huge accomplishment, but we have so much more that we uh, hope that we can do going into it. With the early exit from the SEC tournament, what did you guys do to kind of take advantage of time that you know maybe you guys didn't think you would have? Um, in a way, it gave us an opportunity to rest. Um, and we were kind of going to get that either way it went, but I think that was huge for us because I think we're now playing with a shorter lineup than what we have been in the past three, four weeks. Uh, and I think that that gave players an opportunity to recover, take care of some injuries so that we can go into the NCAA tournament very healthy. Have you had a message for some of these younger players that haven't made the tournament like Kalia? Yeah, um, just – tell them to play their game. I mean, Kali, Kali is very talented. Um, even, you know, some of our younger players, the sophomores, things like that, you know, they, they've been there. They might not have the court experience, but you just got to go out there and play your game. You got to block out everything else. Yeah, it's a great atmosphere um, for women's basketball, but ultimately you just got to go out there, focus and play your game. Um, I know you've been saying for the past few weeks that, you know, there's not one player who's going to be able to replace Jacoby yet, but um, with, you know, it having been a few weeks since she's, uh, She's been unable to play. Have you guys? Do you guys feel confident in your ability to, you know, win games without her? Definitely. Um, I think there's been a lot of players that have stepped up in her absence. I mean, Kalia has been a force on defense, uh, making it very difficult for people to score inside, um, and ba basically cleaning up everyone else's mess. Um, Patches has done an extremely good job replacing some of those points, scoring, and even her defensively locking down some people that would probably or have originally been Shakobia's matchup. So, yeah, a lot of people have stepped up on this team, and I'm confident that even though we're without her, that we'll be able to win. Awesome. Thank you. That's good.